Hello guys and welcome back to the channel. Where today guys, I'll be showing you how to fix table header on Confluence. So guys, the first thing that you of course need to do is go to Google and type in confluence.com. After that, you just need to go and log into your profile or register to Confluence if you haven't already done that, of course. But now guys, let's see how you can actually go and fix table header on Confluence. So to fix or make table headers sticky in Confluence, you need to enable sticky headers. In Confluence, the first row of tables can be set as a sticky header by default. This ensures that the header remains visible while scrolling. However, this feature might not work if the table is inside a layout section or another macro or the table lacks a designed header row. So be careful with that. Then if the default sticky header doesn't work, you can use the table filter and charts for the Confluence app. This paid add-on allows you to freeze multiple rows or volumes. Ensure your table isn't nested within other elements like macros or layout sections, as this can interfere with the sticky headers. If sticky headers aren't feasible, considering splitting your table into smaller sections or using Excel-like macros for better functionality. So guys, that will be everything for this video. I hope that you found this video informative and entertaining, guys. If you did, don't forget to like this video, share it, subscribe to the channel, and put the notifications on, as guys, this really helps us grow our channel. So if you have a few seconds, it will be pretty cool if you could do this for us. So guys, that will be everything for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And guys, as always, I'll be seeing you in the next video on this YouTube channel. Until then, as always, until next time, bye guys.